Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Moulin Rouge. From the screen to the stage, Paris is coming to Piccadilly. The Moulin Rouge is a state of mind. It's a celebration of life and of art and of music and passion and joy. So I think it's, it's quite a good time for it to be coming out because the world can use a little bit of that right now, I think. Suddenly the world seems such a perfect place. It's so fun and we need a little more pure escapism in our lives these days. So I think it's just, it's a celebration. It's such a fun night. I believe you were expecting me. Yes. Moulin Rouge the musical is adapted for Moulin Rouge the movie directed by Baz Luhrmann 20 years ago. Baz has been involved at many, many, many steps of the way and really given like some amazing key creative advice. And he loves the show. It's Orpheus and Eurydice, it's Romeo and Juliet, it's Traviata, all blenderized. And then the other thing was just that the kind of world creation, that big vision that Baz had of uh, something that feels, uh, you know, Belle Epoque Paris and then today it pushed together. That concept with the whole set extending all the way to the very last seat is that whether you're down there or you're at the top, you know, you're in the club, you're part of the Moulin Rouge. And so I think in this theater, that really translates well because the show is probably bigger than the actual physical theater. And as with all West End productions, it's hard not to address the elephant in the room, the looming shadow of COVID. I feel like with COVID, we keep going through these cycles of feeling like we have a hold on it and then we know nothing and we're all just kind of like, oh. I and mean, how damaging would it be if there was tighter restrictions or, or a lockdown? Yeah, I think what people don't understand is it's not just us, it affects. You know, there's like hundreds of people behind the scenes and backstage. And beyond that, it just brings so much joy. Like these shows are kind of the lifeblood of this area of London specifically. Like I feel safer hanging out with the cast than I do with any what else, you know, because I know that nobody else is getting tested every day and is showing up yeah. negative. Yeah. Some of the original songs from the film have been updated, but the classic numbers remain to the delight of the audience. The deafening screams from these 1,200 people who are just, who just have they this really lose their minds. Night. Yeah. It's, it's just, a fun it's night so out fun. for sure. Moulin Rouge opens next week at the Piccadilly Theatre. Thanks, Martel, ITV News.